Welcome to this tutorial on the reverse transcription of ribonucleic acid. The process of reverse transcription was first reported by Howard Martin Temin and David Baltimore. Howard Martin Temin observed the phenomenon of reverse transcription and David Baltimore discovered the enzyme reverse transcriptase which is involved in the process of reverse transcription. The enzyme reverse transcriptase is an RNA-dependent DNA polymerase, which means that it will seek RNA as a substrate and transcribe or reverse transcribe it into the DNA fragment. The process of reverse transcription involves the following steps. Annealing of the primer to the RNA transcript or to the poly A tail in case of eukaryotic messenger RNA. Reverse transcription by reverse transcriptase. Removal of mismatches by RNAs H. Repair of gaps by DNA polymerase 1, pheno fragment. And finally, the complementary DNA strand termed as cDNA is ready for downstream processing. The enzymes employed for reverse transcription in the laboratory are reverse transcriptase, RNAs H, DNA polymerase 1, clino fragment. The process of reverse transcription begins with annealing of the primer. RNA tends to form secondary structures via Watson Crick base pairing. The first step involves denaturation of the RNA by heating in the presence of the gene-specific primer, followed by cooling to room temperature to facilitate primer annealing. The blue represents the RNA strand. The yellow represents the primer which has annealed to the RNA strand. Now in the case of eukaryotic messenger RNA, or mRNA, the primer which can be utilized is an oligo DT primer which binds specifically to the polyadenylation signal at the end of the messenger RNA sequence. In the case of prokaryotic RNA, the primer which needs to be utilized is the gene specific primer. The second step involves reverse transcription, which is facilitated by the enzyme reverse transcriptase. Reverse transcriptase commences transcription at the primer binding site. In the slide, the reverse transcriptase is depicted in black. Following the activity of reverse transcriptase, a double-stranded RNA-DNA hybrid is generated. This double-stranded DNA-RNA hybrid needs to be repaired in order to synthesize cDNA. The enzyme RNAs H is involved in the removal of mismatches. The mismatches in the DNA-RNA hybrid generated by reverse transcriptase are removed by the enzyme RNAs H. Finally, step 4 involves the repair of strand by DNA polymerase 1 clino fragment. DNA polymerase 1 clino fragment repairs the gaps and fills in nucleotides leading to the formation of a double-stranded DNA. The resulting DNA strand can be subjected to DNA sequencing in order to determine the identity of the transcript. The copy number of the transcripts can be determined using real-time PCR. Tutorial on reverse transcription.